the two uh, players from Leicester City football club. Uh, we were doing some yoga and some training and we are so happy. All of us uh, uh, cannot thank you enough guys. Thank you for your support. Really nice to see the different cultures, um, people from different countries to see how football brings them together. So I'm really happy I could, I could be part of it. This is in part of our um, Football Welcomes programme um, that we've run for the last four or five years in partnership with Amnesty International and with our, we've got some brilliant local partners as well so we've got Leicester City Sanctuary here today and also After 18 have been a massive part of the programme for the last, last few years. So the majority of the participants that we've got today have, uh, are actually quite new arrivals to our city, um, living in hotels so to feel that sense of belonging, to feel that they're actually welcome is, is, is vital really. I mean I've had a participant say to me in the past they actually feel physically safer if they've got Leicester City branding so, so for us if we can share that we can share the kit, we can share being part of a Leicester City session. They just feel much more welcome and safer. They make them feel a real part of the community I and mean, they all love football. That's one thing they all love and now they're all fans of Leicester City and um, I think they've been thrilled today to come and meet some players. You know, this is a real chance for them to get out and get some exercise and be with friends and make new friends as well. But I think the relationship with the club is fantastic. A lot of them, uh, they stay in the hotel and they are very difficult for them to find friends, but when they come here football, is they make us like one family. So we are so happy. Uh, Leicester especially is like multi-cultures and uh, it's very good, it's very good, yeah. We've had a bit of a healthy eating workshop, um, so getting the, getting the guys involved to kind of have a think about what's more healthy, think about what they're eating and drinking and the, the positives around that. And then they're having a, a wonderful soccer size session with, uh, with Aura right now. Going away from my family, I was only 16 at the time. Not to a different city, but to a different country. But with all the Leicester City staff, it made it so much easier for me to get used to a new environment. And then obviously I was having the English lessons on top of it to, to get to know the language quicker. And yeah, it was difficult, but when I look back at it, it was a, it was a life experience for me, so, so yeah. No matter what happens in your life, there's always a way to to find a path to, to achieve a dream and I think that's that's my message to, to these people that if they want to, whatever it is they want to achieve in, in life, there's nothing going to stop them as long as they're going to keep going, so, so that is my advice. Perfect, well done. Thank you. Thank you.